What up, what up, what up, everybody? Say what up. What's up? How's it going, everybody? Uh, today, we're going to be watching a video that I've seen a lot of shorts for, but I've never seen the full video. I think you've seen the full video, haven't you? Yeah, but I won't, I won't spoil it. You, you can read what we're watching right there, and without any further ado, you want to start us up? Don't make me push this button. Push it. Everyone laughed at this couple, right. but you should see them now. Welcome back. Charlie here. They say there's someone out there for everyone. Sometimes unusual couples get made Whoa. fun of by people, but these extraordinary couples prove that love Shane is blind. Hannah. First, we have to look at Boris and Elena. In 2011, this Russian couple got married, but when they posted their wedding photos on Facebook, they were shocked. Millions of people ridiculed the couple and made fun of how Elena looked. Right, Some man. comments even called her the world's ugliest bride. Boris and Elena were very sad. They were supposed to be enjoying their honeymoon and had no idea their innocent wedding photos would get so much backlash. Some people online even questioned if their relationship was real. They said there was no way Boris would actually like Elena. Elena was very sad, but on their honeymoon night, Boris told her not wow. to worry. He told Elena that he would be with her forever no matter what people said. But did Boris actually keep to his word? Or did all of the negativity break this couple up? Well, six years after their wedding in 2017, a reporter tracked them down. When the reporter got to Boris's house, he realized he was with a different woman. The uh -uh. reporter said, what happened to Eleanor? Did that, you break no, up? No, no, but no, that's no, when no, Boris no. revealed that call, this woman was Eleanor. She man. went from looking like this to this that, in only six years. Eleanor changed woman. her entire lifestyle, no working way. out every day for years. She also oh, wait, changed was that her the... diet and even had medical surgery. Now no one can call After. Eleanor the world's what? ugliest bride the ever again. Yeah. She yeah. also said that she made all of these changes for herself. I think we can all agree that what? her transformation no is way. amazing. I... And Boris staying with Elena I mean, despite it is, all that's the hardship awesome proves he really her. does love her no matter what. Despite but... all of the hardship, Boris never pressured <sighs> Eleanor to change. Instead, she did it all by herself. I think this proves Dang. Boris and Eleanor are a perfect example of true love. Now, we have to look at this couple named Eudoxy and Grand P. Eudoxy Yao like is a, a singer from Ivory Coast, yeah, and ridiculous. Grand P is a rich rapper from oh. Guinea. This oh, really? unlikely couple got married in 2022. Eudoxy like Yao became kid. famous mm. for singing and being a plus-size model and is also a multi-millionaire. Grand P suffers from progeria, which makes him look a lot younger than his real age okay. of 32. This led to some people calling Eudoxy like a gold 12. digger. But Eudoxy and Grand P have proved all of the haters wrong. They have stayed together no matter what, including claims that Grand P cheated on Eudoxy. Today, the couple live together in a mansion in Guinea and have even made various songs like together. 12. Some people call them the most famous power couple in all all of Africa. Moving on, we have to look at wow. Esteban and Dana. In 2020, what this Colombian that? couple broke the internet. That was after they posted this photo. It shows Dana Sultana hugging her husband, Esteban Londro. But surprisingly, it's the husband who's pregnant here. But how is this even possible? Well, it turns out that both Esteban and Dana are transgender. Oh, Esteban was born female, but identifies as male. Yeah, that's While what I was Dana thinking. Was born oh. male and identifies as female. The couple conceived their baby naturally, if as they both still have their original enough, body parts. Uh, Esteban and Dana did get some criticism after their photos went viral, but they say they don't care as they're happily in love. Their baby went on to be born healthy and happy. Oh, so Today, strange. the couple live together in that. Colombia, I... where Dana is a model. They really prove that love is love, I don't know what to especially say to that. as they did something that I'm many thought wasn't even possible. Like... Moving on, we have to look at Shane and and Hannah. You may have seen this yeah. couple before as they've gone viral in recent years. Their names are Shane and Hannah Burkor. Many people were stunned to see this couple. Hannah is a woman who looks like a model, whereas Shane is a smaller man who can't walk. Because of this, they received many skeptical mm -hmm. comments. People doubted if their relationship was even real. Some said that Hannah was too attractive for Shane. Other people also said What's that Hannah must be a gold anything? digger. And some that. even accused them of faking their love to get views and fame. 
Well, Hannah actually first reached out to Shane. This was after Hannah watched a documentary about disability that featured Shane. They soon began FaceTiming for hours and hours every day, and two years later, got married. But are people's allegations about this couple actually true? Is Hannah simply a gold digger after Shane's money? Well, it turns out that Hannah was actually richer than Shane all along. Shane lived in a smaller house and made less money. In fact, it was Hannah who was more nervous about meeting Shane. So, people's oh. accusations about Hannah yeah. are totally wrong. And now You're this wrong. couple even yeah. mock their haters mm -hmm. using humor. This couple really takes good care of each other both emotionally and physically. They have a great love life and also a great intimate life too, proving all of their critics totally wrong. And this hilarious. couple really is inspiring once you learn their backstory. Hannah and Shane are still happily married to this day, proving that love truly is blind. When it comes to true love, it's not about how people look or how much money they make. It's all about what's on the inside. Now we have to look at Jolison and Evan. Right, it's no secret that two. many women really like tall guys, really but some may say that Jolison Fernandez de Silva is too tall. He is in oh. fact the tallest oh. man in Brazil, okay. measuring in at 7 feet and I'm, 8 I'm inches. Seven, eight. Jolison was born <laughs> with a tumor on his pituitary gland. This caused an excess of growth hormones, meaning that he grew massive incredibly fast. It was very hard for Jolison, but he soon became famous for his height, which allowed him to meet his future wife, Eva Medeiros. Eva is only 5 feet tall, meaning that this Dang. couple has an extreme height oh. difference. But despite this, <laughs> they're still madly <laughs> in love. The couple met on Facebook yeah. and got married two years later. But in 2016, Jolison was heartbroken. That was when he realized him and Eva were unable to conceive, no, that's meaning that what? they couldn't Apology? give birth to a child. Like, but luckily this couple now plans to adopt, meaning that they can have their dream family that they've always wanted. Next, we have to look at this couple named Sean and Mindy. Uh, this is Sean Stevenson yeah. and Mindy Niss. Mindy is an average height, but her husband Sean is only 2 feet and 8 inches tall. The two were both motivational speakers. They met in 2009 and three years later got married. Mindy is 4 foot 11 making her far taller than Sean. But despite this, the couple still have a great life. And Mindy says Sean is one of the most intimate people she's ever met. Sean has brittle bone disease, meaning that, among other things, his bones can break very easily. He has had over 500 fractures in his lifetime. Oh. But despite this, Sean is a motivational speaker, exercises every day, and is happily married to Mindy. Finally, we have to look at Flavio and Elizabeth. This is the one I don't It's get. pretty obvious yeah. what makes this couple stand out. That's right, Flavio is taller than Elisabetta. Oh wait, not that. Wait, it's actually that Flavio is nearly <laughs> double her age. Flavio Briatore is a billionaire businessman from Italy, and well, Elisabetta Gregoresi oh. is an Italian model. Many were surprised when they okay. became an item, and even accused Elisabetta of being a gold digger. But the couple insists that's not the case. They even have a 12-year-old son named Falco. Flavio is 72 years old, while Elisabetta is 42. Some said there's no way Elisabetta would go for Flavio. But surprisingly, okay. Elisabetta is not 42. the first supermodel uh. Flavio has dated. Dang. Flavio previously dated famous supermodel Naomi Campbell. I think all of these couples prove that true love is blind, oh, and geez. that you should never judge a book by its cover. But now it's time for you to make your level. voice heard. Comment below which of these couples was the most- Alright, so, what do you think about that? <laughs> I mean- I think that people need to meet people, I mean, unless it's like, the handicapped people, and, or if they're around the same age, but like the tall dude and the really short girl, I think yeah. that's perfect. Yeah. But like, 72 and 42 with a 12 year old son yeah that's a little absurd i i mean i mean you do you i mean they're both of of age and everything so i don't have an issue with that but i mean i personally don't get it but a lot of people don't get things that i do so i mean you know it is what it is but people shouldn't yeah. be making fun of them and all that stuff you know that's just not mm -hmm. right but anyway, let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Make sure you smack that like button. Just not too right. hard. Just not too hard because we want to. We don't want to break it. We yeah, need we the need like that. button. 
Uh, we'll see you all next time. God bless y'all. Y'all have a good one. Peace. Peace.